Hi, it's Fiona. I'm passionate about keeping horses healthy naturally. So today we're going to make a honey garlic infusion. Really simple. So you just need some good quality honey. Now honey is full of antioxidants. It's really good for wound healing and for coughs and colds. Over here we prize Manuka and Jarrah honey. Wherever you are, you'll find a honey that's really good quality. Make sure it's not processed. Really good top quality honey. Now to the honey, we're going to add garlic. Garlic's antifungal, antiviral, antimicrobial. It supports the liver and it also is really good for diabetes, so may support the EMS type horse. Don't feed a lot of garlic, but a little bit's okay. There are quite a few studies now that say that garlic does help and support the cancer. It may help with seasonal allergies, and I have used it with thrush and lump fever and all those sorts of things. Don't put garlic directly into uh, perhaps an area like seedy toe. It can be a little bit too strong, but in a mix it's quite okay. So about 100 mils of honey, you can make more, to about one clove of garlic. Now you can peel it, you don't have to. Chop it up into chunks. Two or three chunks probably for one clove. Pop it into the honey. This then needs to infuse into the honey for roughly two weeks. Put it on a windowsill unless you're living in Australia and it's 40 degrees for two weeks. But keep it where it's a little bit warm if possible. And then at the end of the two weeks you can take the garlic out and we have this lovely infused honey. Keep it somewhere cool, don't put it in a hot feed shed like we get over here. Perhaps in the pantry or in the laundry, you can use it for wounds. You can make it into a tea for yourself. And if you let the tea cool, you could um, syringe it into a horse that has a cough as well. So, nice, easy little recipe. Infused honey with garlic. Wishing you and your horses all the very, very best of health and happiness.